I uh, really uh, don't know why it is that uh, all of us are so committed to the sea, except I am, uh, I think it's because, in addition to the fact that the sea uh, changes and the light changes and uh, ships change, it's because uh, we all came from the sea. And it is an interesting uh, biological fact that all of us have in our veins the exact same percentage of salt in our blood that exists in the ocean. And therefore, uh, we have salt in our blood, in our sweat, in our tears. We are tied to the ocean. And when we go back to the sea, whether it is to sail or to watch it, we are going back from whence we came. And therefore, it's quite natural that the United States and Australia, separated by an ocean, but particularly to those of us who regard the ocean as a friend, bound by an ocean, should be meeting uh, today in Newport to begin this great sea competition. President and Mrs. Kennedy were among the spectators as Australia's Gretel challenged for the America's Cup. The U.S. Weatherly proved the better of the two yachts throughout and successfully defended the old mug against the 18th challenge since the United States brought the cup from England in 1861. The successful skipper of the Weatherly, Boss Mossbacker, was doubly rewarded. 